Hello and welcome Good back. Day. So this time we were Very well. not talking to her, we were gonna fuse and get an Empress persona. Okay, hopefully that's what we're gonna... Oh. Splendid. Here we go, we get some new abilities here. Uh, weakness amp greatly increases damage when striking a weakness. That's really good. Welcome to the velvet. Room. Okay, the moon grows full. Well, is that gonna trigger something, or we don't really know anymore what's gonna happen? Ah, you dwell there. Let's see, Shall you Vishnu. You can't control this one yet. There's an empress, sixty-two. We have to give up two this personas for it, choice. though. Trumpeter, do we really want to give that one up? Mm. Maybe we can give up a few others first. Um, lovers, we don't Take need that anymore. Star, we do... Consider. Well, fool, those two. Are you satisfied with this? Yeah, sure, Please let's get to the starfish. Multi target boost. And. Hmm. Survive a fatal blow. I think for these it's better to just go with the auto things because. It appears it um, will receive a. So it begins. Anything that's gonna fit the persona is probably gonna come to it through leveling it up anyway. Okay, it's gonna get some new shit here. Fast heal. Oh, that's not really... Hmm. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Heavy Almighty. Medium Almighty, okay. Let's see, no Empress available now. I guess we gave up one of the ones we needed for that. So, do we want to give up Trumpeter? We haven't gotten to use him yet. Sun, oh no. Star. Which one is that again? Rank 5. Oh, that's Hayasa, right? Strength. Kali. This persona is powerful. Yeah, let's Please get this one. What skills to inherit. Heavy Almighty. High counter. Multi-target boost. Mm, and enduring soul. It appears it will receive a. It's finally time. Okay, that's gonna be good. I mean, filling up the compendium is going to be good anyway, so... I think it's going to be a rare occasion where we don't have personas for what we need to do, especially when we have a full party now. Next physical will more than double, okay. Mm. Heavy strike, heavy slash. Do we need both? Severe slash to one. Can get rid of that one though. Okay, still no. This would be a wise choice. I have to give up Kali for that. Devil. Lilith. This persona is powerful. It's another boob lady. That one's gonna get a lot of level ups. I guess we can give up the trumpeter for it. This would be a wise choice. Wait. Ananta? What the hell is this that? Power might be too much for you. Okay, well, I think we can go with this. this. Persona is what do you wish to inherit? Let's see, we have a bunch of stuff here. We can get three of them. I'm thinking this, this. Hmm. Yeah, let's get it these appears. actually. It will receive an Im well then. Shall we begin? Yeah, she sure looks freaky. Okay. 
So she's gonna, oh, level 70 actually, that's pretty good. Dark attack that reduces HP of one foe by 50%. That's interesting. Medium chance of charm on all. In this case, I think we can get rid of the barrier thing. We have items for that and also Ken can do that. Um, temperance, that's gonna be a bad deal in terms of levels. Okay, let's just summon an empress then. Let's go with, uh, I guess this one. Please take a. Is this acceptable? Yeah, it's not too expensive. Are you finished? Oh shit! Oh, well, uh, best friends. Okay. I am leaving. I'm not really sure if I see the point of those more than double next attack things like how much more than double that would be kind of good to know to see if that's even worth it you know okay well we're going to Mitsuru uh, it's gonna be there I'm gonna grab a drink here okay hello okay <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna hang out with her. Here we go. So she wanted to stop by some place. Oh, fast food again. So this is what the interior looks like. It's smaller than I expected. Is this your first time? Well, technically, yes. But I did pass by once with Akihiko. Uh, that doesn't count. So. I understand that you don't eat with utensils here? No, you just hit it with your fists and then you eat it. My lack of like knowledge a barbarian. on this subject is a serious problem. In all honesty, it's a good thing you're here. Is it actually profitable to sell these items at such low prices? Yeah, because it's garbage food. I'd be interested to know the average cost per unit. Oh, sorry, I found myself lost in thought again. In truth, I didn't ask you here just to eat. I wanted to express my personal thanks to you. All right, not sure what right I did, now, but our strength you know. and conviction are being tested to their limits. We've only made it this far because we've been blessed with each other's partnership. I know I've been asking a lot of you, even more than the others, but I truly appreciate it. I just wanted to make sure you knew that. All right. Well, that's not, that's not bad, you know, I appreciate it back, I guess. Oh, I didn't realize we were talking for so long. It would be rude to let the food grow cold. Shall we begin? All right, let's eat some junk. Okay, let's see, evening, there's probably not going to be a lot we can do. Oh, okay. Oh, welcome back. You're late. Ryoji-kun was just leaving. Oh, hey there. Chilly out, huh? Hope you don't go catching a cold. You know, I stop by here pretty often. Weird we never see each other. Well, I'm out of here. See you later. Well, I'm kind of always doing other shit. Later, Ryoji. I hope I didn't miss any important things by not hanging out with him at the dorm or anything. Was that Ryoji-san? He said he was going home. I mean, you were just looking at him, but yes, that was him. Why was he here? To see Junpei. They've been hanging out a lot ever since the school trip. But the rules state that visitors aren't allowed here. Wait, is that true? Yeah, but Kirijo Senpai said it's cool as long as no one stays late. I don't think we have anything to worry about. He is dangerous. Okay, there's something weird going on, that's for sure. Dangerous? Ryoji-kun? Come to think of it, he did hit on Mitsuru-senpai the first time he met her. That's a bold move. But having him around has really helped cheer you up, Junpei-kun. Well, no point in dwelling on the past, right? 
Won't change a damn thing. That's true. Hmm? What's up, Ai Chung? I'm fine. It's just. I envy you, Junpei. I'm a machine. So I don't understand what it feels like to live. Really? But you don't seem that different. In my case, it's more accurate to say that I'm operational as opposed to alive. There are times when I malfunction, but I can always be repaired. Well, if we were all like you, then we never have to worry about dying. Oh, crap! Uh, I don't have time to talk right now. I've got a mountain of homework. Serves me right for slacking. Oh, no use whining. Okay, he's actually doing on homework now. I guess hell finally froze over. Well, better call it a night then. So we never got to the bottom of why he's dangerous, though. The gift of life is not something I should possess. A weapon is much more difficult to operate when it's alive. That said, I believe I understand the concept of loss. Leader, the thought of something happening to you, it makes me... Um... Don't... Stop overanalyzing. Forgive me. I'm just... Concerned. You are very special to me. I can't explain why. But I never want to leave your side. I want to protect you at all costs. To be there for you always. Hmm, okay. I apologize for keeping you. You must be tired. So much has happened in so little time. I'll return to my room as well. Good night. Okay, so we still don't know exactly why she's... Yoji Mochizuki. He is dangerous. Can you explain? What is this unsettling feeling? I am a machine. I can't die. So no one will have to grieve for me. I have to do something. Are you gonna go fucking I assassinate him or something? I don't suffer anymore. Okay, this could get ugly. I mean, she's a fucking tank, basically. So if she's gonna go kill this guy, that might be bad. But, let's have a look. What else can we do? Nothing, 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 nothing. There might be some new videos. Oh, there is a new video. Okay, let's see. Oh boy, what is he doing? Well, it could be worse. Okay, he's training, basically. This room really is too small to practice in. Yeah, and you're gonna break your TV. Oh. But come to think of it, I guess I don't have to practice in secret anymore. Although, I don't live on the first floor here, so I might be disturbing the people downstairs. Hmm. I chose a long weapon so I could match the reach of an adult. But then I learned that long weapons are actually better suited for tall people. <laughs> okay, you're not coming to the final boss battle, that's for sure. Oh, I hit my shin again. Jeez, I hope I get taller soon. Also, how many milk cartons is he drinking? Look oh, at yeah. his table. Where'd my milk go? Well, that was just what it was. Oh well. Is he gonna be able to even... okay. <sighs> Maybe I should be drinking more milk. Hmm... It hurts my stomach sometimes, though. <sighs> okay. I once drank a whole carton of milk in like a few minutes because I had to leave for a bus. That was kind of an important bus. And um, I got very... That did not feel good. And I barely even got my way out there to the bus. But I got there in the end, but it felt like I had to just cancel the whole day. So don't drink too much milk too quickly. Um, well, the problem now is, what the hell do we do? Arcade, cafe... Hmm. Do we... I mean, we have... There's not that much we can do at this point, really. 
I think this thing is just gonna... Because there's no... Yeah, because this is evening. So I guess we can do the dating site thing again. So... I really don't know here. I mean... We didn't have a lot of points last time we talked to him, so I guess we can we can increase the thing with him, you know. Okay, almost full moon. Something might happen here. Uh, okay, I want to see you. Please come to the music room. Okay, something's happening for some reason in the music room. Maybe he wants to play piano again. Maybe he's been practicing. I sure hope so, because the last time it sounded pretty dog shit. Um, okay, music room is here. Let's go. Let's save before this. This could turn into a whole thing. I don't know. And he usually increases the level of our personas, so, you know. Okay, you want to practice or something? Thanks for coming. Uh, what happened? Well, how do I put this? I suddenly just got this feeling that I'm running out of time, and I felt like I had to see you. I had to talk to you. <sighs> Sorry, I'm not even sure what I wanted to say to you. So, I guess for today, I'd like to say thanks. Thanks, question mark? It hasn't been that long since we met, but I feel like I've learned so much by spending time with you. I just really wanted to thank you for that. You showed me around the school and the city. I got to hang out with you and the others. Yeah, the sheet music on the thing in the back is still all kind of messed up. But okay, whatever. I even got to go on a trip with you. That was a lot of fun. Mm-hmm. It's been a joy to experience and learn new things every day. Okay, so he's a piano prodigy as well now. like this uh, when did you can I play too <laughs> that's an interesting suggestion I'm sure it'd be wonderful if we could play together but maybe we'll save that for another time when I saw those couples in Kyoto or when I visited you guys at the dorm I realized that's what it really means to build a connection with someone it's that feeling of overcoming something together and keeping each other going. Both sides need to come to an understanding. That's how connections are built, right? I want you to know that you're important to me. I know I said I wanted us to be friends, but I actually want to be something more. Uh, wait. What about you? Uh, what do you what do you mean? I don't understand. I don't really get it myself, but I. Excuse me. Oh, it's you. It's indeed Sorry. me. I hope I didn't interrupt. I think it was a good thing you interrupted I right was now. Just passing through the hall, and I heard someone playing a beautiful song on the piano. So I thought I'd stop by to watch the performance. Who was the one playing? Was it you? Uh, not me. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I wanted to ask. It might have just been my imagination, but... 
I thought I sensed Ryoji-kun's presence in this room. Were you not with him? Okay, I'm officially insane. Hmm? Okay. And... Okay. What? Okay. Okay. That's not normal. So there is something off about him, that's for sure. And he just up and vanished after saying he didn't have much time left. Oh! And there's all these hints about him not remembering his past. Yep, something weird is happening. Okay. And I'm guessing we're gonna find out when the... When the... what you call it? The um, full moon comes around. Well, there's nothing... I guess we can just uh, put in another thing. Valorous feats of a Sengoku general. That's probably just gonna be Valor. I mean, Courage. Okay. Let's put a few extra points into Mitsuru. Right? That seems... Yeah, okay. Let's just do it. So hopefully we never have to do one of the hangouts where nothing happens. Morning. Okay, she wants to protect us. We're counting on you. Yes. Okay, normal school. Nothing crazy is happening. Class has ended. Nothing out of the ordinary. Okay, she wants to hang out. Okay, well, we have nothing else. So, let's do it. Here we go. Hang out. Feel like we're gonna probably max her out sooner than the others. Hello. She is a main character Thank after you. all, and she's the only main character now. We have. Interesting. I think. So this takoyaki doesn't contain an entire octopus, but only a small portion. I mean, that does make sense. The entire creature would be far too large for a single person. Sometimes my own ignorance truly astounds me. Want me to treat you? Let's go with that. <laughs> Who do you think I am? Please, allow me to be the one to treat you. Alright, well, I'm not complaining. What? They don't accept credit cards. <sighs> Seems like I have to do it anyway. So it's filled with dice octopus. Interesting. Mmm. There's a mild sourness combined with the chewy texture of the seafood. Quite flavorful. Hmm? Are there other ingredients mixed in? In any case, it's quite good. C'est très bon. C'est très bon. Reminds me. Akihiko once mentioned this place. Hmm. Speaking of Akihiko. Don't you think he's been acting differently lately? I can't place my finger on it, but I've known him for quite a long time. It feels like something's changed. Well, his friend died. Maybe he's just maturing. Are you happy? Of course I'm happy. With all that we've been through, it can be difficult to get over what's happened in the past. But Akihiko is using his experiences to make himself stronger. I'm quite impressed by that. When I look at Akihiko, I can't help but reflect upon my own life. It's the most peculiar feeling. Um, maybe you're anxious? I don't know. Anxious? Hmm. You may be right. Maybe a part of me is panicking because I feel like I'm being left behind. Sorry, don't mind me. Should we have picked the love one? I'm not sure. I don't know, I'm not sure if we can fuck it up this early. That would be a bit silly, wouldn't it? 
I don't even know what I'm talking about. I do remember I Sorry messed it up in Persona 4, like though, on one just of them. Forget I said anything. I'm rooting for you. Hmm? I'm not sure what you mean. That takoyaki was absolutely delicious. We should eat here again sometime. I remember in Persona 4 I messed up the... Nauto? I think that was the name. Because I picked the wrong dialogue oh, option, so then... We didn't get the porker. Okay. Uh, maybe I guess in this, is in her room? Okay. It's kind of strange. Shouldn't she be around here somewhere? Where is her room? Is it up here? Let's see. Vacant, Amada, Junpei, your room, Sonata. So I suppose... Oh, okay. I guess the chicks are here. Mitsuru. So we can't just barge into their rooms. She's not even there, okay. Well... What can we do then? We ran out of dating things. Um, I guess we can work. Is there nothing else we can do? Let's just walk around a little and see. Do we get something if we take the challenge? Nah, it's just a burger. That's closed. We haven't... There could be some books that we haven't gotten. We should check that out the next day. Charm. Well, we don't need that anymore. Okay, well... Let's just have a little look. not really much for us to do anymore. We haven't played games. What do they do? Academics? Hang on. Races to equip Persona's magic. Does it carry over to... to when we level up the other ones? I'm not really sure. But if we can level up the magic of this one, I mean, why not? Cost a bit of money though, but sure, we haven't done this yet, so let's try it. Okay, three. Oh well, that's not the dumbest thing we could do, I guess. Oh, we forgot to ask the guy for the samurai helmet. I've been looking for you. What are you doing here? I kind of just ended up here somehow. Did you teleport? It's so strange. The sky and the ground look all weird. And there's no one around. <sighs> Something bad's happening right now. But for some reason, I feel at peace. Have you forgotten? What? This is the dark hour. Ordinary people shouldn't be free to roam about. You. You've adapted to it somehow. Too well for a human. Uh, yeah, it is kind of weird. Everything's I weird. Understand. That's why I feel this way whenever you are around. You are dangerous. You are my enemy. Your enemy? Enemy. That's right. It was on a night like this, with a full moon. It was... a long time ago. Yes. We've met once before. Okay, now the plot thickens. You and I were enemies. Who... am I? Who are you? I kinda wanna I know too. I am Igis, the last of the anti-shadow suppression weapons. 
I was created to destroy shadows. So he is a shadow? Created to destroy. And you, your true name is Death. You are the shadow I sealed away ten years ago. Shadow? So is he the final boss, basically? <laughs> Okay, I guess it's just about to kill this guy. Yes, ten years ago, on the night when I was born, I stood on this very bridge. My sole purpose was to destroy shadows. That is the reason why I was given both a sense of self and a persona. I am the bearer of the 13th Arcana. Everyone oh, knows shit. death. But when I came into being, a part of my power was broken off and scattered. I wasn't at my full strength back then. I was incomplete. Even so, your power was still far too great. Okay, I guess don't get killed now. We already have a lot of casualties in our group. Since I was unable to defeat you, my only option was to seal you away. However, under the circumstances, there was only one suitable vessel. A human boy who had the misfortune of being nearby. I had no other choice. Inside of him all this time. Oh boy, that sentence. Okay. I wittingly led him to discover my twelve missing pieces. And then. Is he gonna unleash this full power now? That he realizes? I get it. I understand now. I remember oh, everything. No. Okay, shit's gonna I go bad. Exactly who and what I am. Okay, shit's getting real. Maybe Fuka should Don't get in on this and send us. I guess. You can't win. I'm even stronger than before. The machine is created to serve a specific purpose. I will destroy you. That is my only reason for existing. It doesn't have to be that way, I guess. Okay, it seems like it's pretty OP. That could be a problem for us. Oh no, is she gonna... Oh no. I can't carry out my mission. I'm a machine, but I can't fulfill its purpose. I have no reason to exist. I'm sorry, everyone. Are we having yet another casualty now? So sorry. Please no. Scared. Oh boy. Oh okay. Juno, uh, did, did something happen? Yukari, what's the matter? Well, I realize it's a full moon tonight. You did too, huh? Oh God, I'm turning into a workaholic. <sighs> Wait, is something actually going on? Yeah, I think maybe the most important thing ever is going on. We're not certain of anything yet, but we can't find Igus. What? Where could she have gone? At one point, I was able to sense a persona, but I lost Igus right after that. You sensed a persona? Could it have been Straka? Well, she hasn't detected any of them, but we can't be positive. I've pinpointed her location. Oh boy, okay, that was quick. Alright, call the others. Let's see what's going on over there. Well, either he's gonna be gone, or we just come to find half-dead Igis. I'm sorry. I... I... remember everything. I remember who I am. 
who he is. Leader, I know why I wanted to be by your side. I'm sorry. I failed. It's going to be okay, don't worry. I'm sorry. You have no reason to apologize. Oh shit, he's still here actually. You? Okay, boss fight, question mark. Ryoji-kun? Wait, what are you doing here? I guess... Okay, she's not functioning. What is going on? Hopefully we can fix her. It's all my fault. What? You did this? Hold on, Akihiko. He's not showing any signs of aggression. Now tell us, who or what are you? Turns out, I'm not so different from the creatures you call shadows. You're a shadow? I'm more than just an ordinary shadow. He's like the, the big bad, I'm apparently. I'm the Apprizer, born from the union of the Twelve Arcana. The Apprizer? I remember everything now. The terrifying truth about the shadows and about me. I can't. It's all so hard to believe. You know the truth about the shadows? I do. What? The shadows are here to facilitate the rebirth of the maternal being. As for the appraiser, it draws the maternal being to it, allowing her to awaken. And the appraiser? That's you? That's right. His maternal being... What is it? Is that gonna be the final boss then? Whatever this She's guy is... She's on a level of her own. No words in our language can describe her. Just like your... Mother-in-law. Or something. Insert mother-in-law joke here. A man collected hordes of shadows and contained them in a laboratory. That's where I was born, but the unification was interrupted, and I awoke before I was complete. After that, Igis took me down, and I returned the favor. Igis? Is this for real, Ryoji? She knew she couldn't destroy me completely, so out of desperation, she sealed me within a child who just happened to be nearby. That child grew up carrying me inside him. And by some twist of fate, he later made his way back here. He even transferred to your school. A transfer student? You don't mean... That's right. I've lived inside him for a long time. Wait. So he is Pharaoh's. And then when he left that time... He materialized in the real world? And I was that kid? But how? And when his persona awakened, the twelve shadows did as well. Oh, it's all about me. Okay. All in order to become one with so... me. So... Okay, so I was the kid. Okay. Ryoji, you're the appraiser? And you were inside of him? Oh, please stop saying that. How the hell do you expect us to just believe all that? That's all my fault. I'm sorry, but there's more I need to tell you. Okay. Okay, we're okay. Maybe we should get off this bridge before traffic starts moving again. He's completely worn out. Let's let him rest for now. I guess needs us too. We'll pick up where we left off after that. Okay, well... Hmm... <clears throat> Pharaoh's was Rio... yeah, okay, makes sense. Okay, well... That... <sighs> Jesus, what do you even say about that? Uh, okay, well, I guess we still gotta go to school though. Right? He's awake now. 
Let's meet tonight on the fourth floor. Got it. All right. I'll see you then. Also, we have to remember to talk to that teacher. I keep forgetting. Damn you, Ryoji. Mm. Uh, do we have to go straight? Oh, we. Okay, I kind of want to save the game. It looks like we're all here. Are you okay, Ryoji kun? Yeah, I'm okay. Thanks. Besides, I have more to tell you guys. Ryoji kun. Then allow me to jump right in. We have many questions that need answers, after all. Yesterday, you said the shadows were here to facilitate the rebirth of the maternal being. Tell us more about this. What happens if she returns? I'm guessing big ass boss fight. The maternal being is called Nyx. Who the hell's Nyx? Nyx is the mother of shadows. In ancient times, she bestowed death upon this world. If she awakens, the world will be swallowed by darkness, and all life will perish. Okay, that's a bit extreme. All life? Are you saying everyone will die? It'd be more accurate to say that we'll all surrender the will to live. Wait, are, are you talking about the lost? Okay, every single human will become like the lost. Yep. The That's fall. the fall. But there's still a way to stop it from happening, right? Nuke it. Nuke it with everything we have. What? Don't tell me there's nothing we can do. I'm sorry. Wait, why are you apologizing? Are you saying there's no way to stop it? That's right. You heard the bell. That's when it was all decided. Was that like a call for this Nyx thing to come? I'm the appraiser. The appraiser of death. The fact that I'm here at all proves the fall is coming. The fall is coming? Well, we kind of got to try something. What? When will it happen? I don't think you'll live to see next spring. Okay, that's ominous. That's barely any time at all. <sighs> what are you guys freaking out about? Nick Schmix, am I right? All we gotta do is win and we're golden. I'm gonna I'm gonna agree with you on this one. We haven't lost a single fight yet, have we? Yeah, Junpei's right. You can't win. When you're up against Nyx, power doesn't mean a thing. It's like trying to fight the inevitable, like death or the flow of time. Nyx can't be defeated. She just can't. What? This is bullshit! This is all so sudden. Yeah, Ken hasn't even dropped his balls yet, you know, and he's just gonna die. I was born from a collection of shadows, but now I have a human form. So I can talk with you, laugh with you, cry with you. It's the gift I received for existing within him, and because of that, I can give you a choice. A choice? Nix's arrival is unavoidable now, but you can choose to live in peace until she arrives. You just have to kill me. What? If the appraiser disappears, all recollection of the Dark Hour would go with me, and that would erase any memories of this hopeless reality. There'd be no way for you to remember anything. When the fall comes, it'll happen in an instant. You won't have to suffer at all. We'll forget everything? I'm saying you can go back to your normal lives. And by doing that, you might buy a little time and delay the fall too. Technically, I'm the same as Nyx. 
so I can't be killed. But thanks to him, there's a part of me that's become human. So if it's done by his hand, then it may be possible. Does that mean that I can kill Nyx? Yoji-kun. That would be an important question me, right now. Everything will stay just as it is. With no hope for salvation, you'll live every day paralyzed by the fear of your impending death. And I don't want to put you through something like that. Um... I'm not going to kill you, bro. This is something only you can do. No one else. Well, I'm not doing it. Well, I definitely don't want my memories erased. I mean, forgetting all this would be like trying to hide from the truth. Is that really such a bad thing? If you don't do this, all that awaits is despair greater than you can possibly imagine. You don't understand the terror of certain death. Don't make your decision without at least thinking about it first. Uh, why is this happening? You don't have to decide right now. There's still some time. December 31st, New Year's Eve. You have until then to think about it. Okay, that's like a month or so. After that, I'll dissolve into the blackness of the dark hour and lose my physical form. Yachi. When Nyx arrives, I'm going to disappear anyway. So please, don't worry about me. I'll be back when New Year's Eve rolls around. Okay, so we're just gonna pretend like everything's fine and dandy until then? Hey! Ryoji, wait! Stop, Junpei-kun! I felt Ryoji-kun's presence vanish just now. There's no point in chasing him. He's gone. So we just walked out the door just to not freak us out by teleporting, basically. Ryoji-kun. I guess he'll be back. Okay, well, this is, um... Okay, well, we're definitely going to fight. We're not going to just give up. This fucking Nyx character, we're going to fucking nuke the shit out of them. But, more importantly, we have plants that we can harvest. That's, you know, is there anything more important than this? Here we go. Got some tomatoes. Here we go. Plant these. And we have to remember... The fucking teacher, but next time. Thanks for watching, bye bye.